Good morning, everybody. It is day 48. Uh, April the 6th. It's a Tuesday morning. And, man, it is going to be a good day, I think. Let's see what my back does. It's a little aggravated this morning. But it's part of it. No pain, no main. So anyway, goal for today is to get to Punch Bowl Shelter, which is a little over 25 miles. So it's 7.30 in the morning. I should be rolling up in there sometime around 5.30 or 6, depending on how the day goes. And, uh... Yeah, it's supposed to be 76 or 75 today. That's hot. It's really hot, but it's not cold. So, and it's not raining. So I'll take it. I'll take a little bit of sweat over freezing fingers any day. So, all right. Moving forward, heading north. Right off the bat, isn't that something? What a beautiful planet. Awesome. Alrighty guys, I made it to the top of a pretty steep climb, it wasn't horrible, but as you can see, I've made it to the tip of High Cock Knob. <laughs> Alright, <sighs> just the tip. Alright, so I've been walking with Tin Man a little bit this morning. Tin Man was a YouTuber from last year. He uh, got off the trail when uh, everyone else did with COVID. And he's back on, he's gonna finish up, but yeah, I used to watch his videos last year, so it was kind of neat to run into him. So uh, yeah, Tin Man. Real nice guy. Anyway, today's hiking's been gravy. I mean, couldn't ask for better terrain. 
even the climbs are, you know, relatively easy. So, yep, hope it keeps us up. It'll be a great day. All right, moving on. That's the James River and I'm heading down there to the I'm gonna have to cross the James River Bridge here in a little bit I think it's about eight miles away though so I must be going way 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 around that bend way over there somewhere and uh, well it's all downhill though all the way to the river you know what that means it's uphill on the other side well Heading north. Now, wouldn't this be a nice shelter to stay at? Got this creek right here. Great water source. Check out the the log book. See what's going on here. Matt's Creek Shelter. What's that little thing? Go down Hercules Road. All right, over the bridge, across the James River, back into the woods. This bridge is Pancake Mike's Bridge. Really nice. All right, so I got the umbrella out because it is blazing hot. It's 81 degrees, no wind. Man, one extreme to the other, freezing cold and then burning up. But I guess, well, it's not snowing, it's not raining. So anyway, I'm gonna keep on it. Oh, it's hot.
All right, so I'm about two thirds of the way up from the river bridge. Man, that was a climb and a half getting up here. Dang. Anyway, it's a nice view from up here. It's called Fuller's Rocks. And, uh, well, that was some effort. Plus, it's a billion degrees out. I feel like I'm standing on the sun. <laughs> anyway, got about another mile to the top. And then, uh, six or so more miles to the shelter. Anyway, I think I'll sit here for a minute. made it to the top holy crap that mountain was an ass kicker I'm beat oh. the same view as the other is right below me oh. that's all right that's a wasp land on me just now pretty <sighs> all right so that's the top of bluff mountain right there that was a real nasty climb um there's a monument right here this little boy who was almost five back in 91 over oh, 1891 wandered off and they found him up here. Seven mile hike. Yeah. It's pretty sad. Oh. That took a lot of effort get up here who I am spent <sighs> that's awesome Run off to this side too <sighs> yeah that's pretty sweet a lot of bugs up here close to fly season they're all over the place all right about a mile and a half to go today heading north all right everybody we made it into the punch bowl shelter i believe it's called the punch bowl because there's a lake right over here that I think is the punch bowl. Put my tent right there. Got some waterfront property for the night. Yeah, it's nice. Not too many bugs. I don't think anyone's staying in the shelter here tonight. Everyone's got their tents out. But, uh, man, that was some hard climbing there at the end of the day. We showed up. And you got these three, we got, uh, met these three section hikers. You got Bob and Richard and Dennis Clark. And, uh, yeah, these guys are awesome. We got here. They had a fire going. Richard went and got us some water. I mean, yeah, we're set up, but yeah, had a great day. Like I said, hard climbing there at the end, but it'll be easy tomorrow. Only got 11 to go. <laughs> all right guys check out the view for my tent the sun's setting in the background kind of little lake here not so bad yeah just sit here and chill for a minute 
Then I'm gonna go to bed. All right, everybody. Uh, is that time? Time for bed. I think that uh, today, at the end of the day, I said it, I've said it before, but really challenging. It was really hot today. It was 81 today, according to my thermometer. It's just hot to be climbing mountains like that. <laughs> Whew. But yeah, so ended up doing 25.3 today, which leaves me about 11 tomorrow, which is mostly downhill, which it's going to be a pretty easy day. I should be done by around 11.30 or noon, getting a ride into Lynchburg, Virginia, getting into the Hilton, get a shower, cleaned up, do some laundry, and rent a car, go pick up Terry from the airport on Thursday morning, spend the day together, and then she's going to hike with me on Friday and Saturday, and then taking her back to the airport on Sunday, getting back on the trail Monday. That's the plan. We'll see. We'll see if that all works out. But uh, I think that's what we're going to do. That's tentative plan. But anyway, I'm going to go to bed. I'm really tired. Um, Butter and Cryptic and Roadrunner all made it in. Long day for us all. Anyway, good night. See you in the morning.